It's the dawning of the 20th century. The major powers of Europe are in the process of divvying up the last fragments of the world map among themselves. At long last, the German Empire wants a place where it can bask in the limelight too. It sees its chance along the Bosporus, where temperamental Sultan Abdul Hamid II rules over a vast territory. Time for the Germans to secure the biggest infrastructure project in all of Asia Minor. The Legendary Orient. The Kingdom of a Thousand and One Nights. Where milk and honey flow. The Baghdad Railway is the key to the Orient. It will give the German Empire access to valuable resources. The railroad project is going to be financed by Deutsche Bank, a German bank. You're supposed to make sure that nothing fishy goes on on site. A railroad from Baghdad to Istanbul, brought into being via sound German engineering skill. A bold venture. As long as the project doesn't make a profit, the Sultan has offered to offset any losses with his tax revenues. Needless to say, one is only too glad to help local agriculture increase its earnings. Make sure that grain production develops beneficially. At the same time, it guarantees funding for the Baghdad Railway. Thanks to your logistics support, food production is soon going to gain momentum. Hello. Welcome to episode, I think it's six now. This is the final one in chapter one of the, um, not challenges, what are they called? <laughs> oh, what a good start. Anyway, you know what I mean. Um, so we will try and get through this one without a hitch. So we need to send food. Um, what are we going to do? I mean, they're, they're all like basically right next to the road. So I think that this should be a case of, well, definitely here anyway. Um, just use road transport, I think, will be the best option. Um, or should we put, seems a bit much to put a train station in. What I'll do is I'll probably put a road in from here to here. But um, yeah, let's, let's get going. And we're just going to get this done, basically. Um, Actually, let's let's put the uh, truck stations in first. Uh, let's just make them a bit bigger, though. Ah, do it gets it there, doesn't it? Um, I mean, I probably could put these a bit closer to shorten the route, but I'll tell you what I will do. I will put this bit of road in here just so I can come off the road a little bit. Um, your legendary fellow countryman, Karaben Nemzi, crosses your path. What a splendid coincidence. Accompany the fearless adventurer and stand by him with advice and support. So, yeah, we're just going to come over to here. Um, I'm not going to do anything fancy, just a straight road, that'll do. Um, stick a truck depot, road depot in. That'll do, and we want a new line from here to here. Another new line from here to here. 
Um, and then we need a couple of um, drop-off points inside the cities. Truck unload stop. So uh, we just want to cover all the bread. I'd, I'd say that'd do. Um, yeah, that'd do, I think. Um, and we will do a new line from, uh, yeah, we'll go from there to there. And we'll put a truck stop in here. Uh, I do. Doesn't have to be anything fancy, just as long as it works, that's the main thing. So we go from there to there. Okay, so let's get some vehicles in. Let's get eight. Um, yeah, we get eight. And then what, what we'll do is we'll put two on this line. Um, and then we'll put two on that line. We'll put two on this line. And we'll put two on this line. There we go. Right, so let's speed this up a bit. Um, I will put it on three. I'll put it on maximum speed actually because it does take rather a long time otherwise, doesn't it? So we'll get them going and we will pick it up in a minute once um, things start arriving and stuff starts happening. Okay, so the trucks are starting to take grain to the... Um, bakery if you like so oh wow they've got bread there already so once we get bread delivered here then that should complete that I'd assume uh, oh we got we got rather a lot of bread here haven't we so what I might do is just increase uh these trucks on here um yeah let's just let's just double them up we'll double them ones up um we might need to do something with that because from what i can tell i think if you've got that little eye thing then that means you're losing stock i think um, which I'm not too bothered about at the moment because obviously it's only um, the tutorial story mission, if you like. Christ, are they only just going there, getting there now? Guess so. Did I put any? Hang on. Two. Oh, I haven't put any on this line. What line have I not put any on? No, that's right. I just needed eight vehicles, didn't I? Yeah. I'm just surprised nothing's completed yet. Um, or, or maybe, oh, does it have to... Um, oh, yeah, increase the food level factory. Factory level, even. Yeah, so, wow. Such a bell end. Try and rush through these things. I miss, I don't read it properly. And yeah. So, in that case, what we will do is I am going to. Ah, oh, I didn't want to sell that. <laughs> ah! Oh dear, that was a complete balls up on it. Right. Okay. So, what I wanted to do was. <laughs> I was going to add vehicles to it. So let's double 
double that up. Just double that up. Um, <sighs> dear me, God. Right, let's double these up as well. Um, let's just check, see how this bread is doing. Yeah, see, there's quite there's quite a bit of um, bread here as well. So, um, uh, not bread, grain. So we will double them up as well. Um, how are we doing here? Yeah, we definitely. Um, I think we might need more on here as well. Um, Yeah, so tra tra the shipment and the transport, I, I can never work it out which is which. Um, is the shipment one when it's actually taking the goods to its final destination, or is it the transport one that, yeah, I don't know. So it's definitely increasing anyway, it's getting there. Um, I, ju I just think we might need to just up the vehicles really, to be honest. Um, what can I actually, so cargo, shall I whack a large cargo building on it? Um, shall I stick one that side? Oh, can I put three on it? Yeah, let's put three car extra cargo buildings on there. And let's do the same here as well. <laughs> Pardon me. There we go. That should hopefully solve us losing any stock. So we need to get this to level two. See, I don't know whether I'll be better off with train networks or, see, I think, I think to be honest, I'm gonna become a bit of a train whore. I think everything will be trains. Um, Cause it's the most efficient way to do things. It just makes sense to do trains. Um, yeah. See, it's not really kicking out a huge amount, is it? It's taking quite a while to um, get up there. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll get this to, I'll get this to level one. I'll try and get this a bit closer to it leveling up and then I will bring you back in a bit. Okay, so this is fluctuating about the same kind of stage or state um, around this 66 mark. Um, I'm just wondering whether I might need to up the vehicles on line three just to get a bit more moving. Um, I think that might be where it's just struggling because that definitely seems to be the higher demand in this city. Um, so yeah, I think I think if we just get a bit more going from line three, then I think we will upgrade very soon. I have taken on a side mission, healing a nose. I don't know what the hell. Um, Collect three snake head, uh, snake weed bushes at an altitude of between 220 and 230 meters. So, oh, I've got I've got two apparently. All right, so I just need one more then. Why is that? Oh, well, done it. <laughs> right. Let's just have a quick look at this. Right, something's definitely going production and shipment. See, I don't get that. Um, Your faithful companion, Hadji Halef Omar, was taken captive by a savage desert tribe. Rescue him. Deliver food to the desert tribe to ransom. Oh, so I've just got to literally deliver food. Oh, okay. Um, 
Well, well, that's interesting. How the hell? When I've got this red line here, how am I meant to... Um, uh, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Um, right, what is going on with this? Because it's not... It's kind of stalled. Why is it stalling? Um... I should have plenty going in here, so I don't see what the issue is. And that's, as far as I know, it's in a good location. Uh, I should be covering all the bread demand, so, and that is as well, so, hmm. I'll tell you what, let's just, let's just try and put, um, See if I can build out here. Uh, no, I don't. I don't need a. Um, I just need a drop off point, don't I? Drop off point right here. There we go. Don't get much closer than that, does it? <laughs> um, I mean, this would probably help the. Uh, this would help the delivery. Um, the production and everything as well, wouldn't it? Um, I mean, to be honest, I could probably do with a train station, really, but, you know, that's a bit of a trick. And <laughs> um, I don't know. Um, I don't know. Go with four. Um, and what was that there? No, nope, wrong button, that one. Right, hopefully that might help with production and stuff a bit. Because that's definitely stalling. Should I have put a train in? I don't know. Mm. I don't know. I don't know why this red line is here. Is that just to indicate mountains or? I don't know. God knows. I have no idea. Hmm. Yeah, it seems a bit. It seems like it's really struggling to get up there, doesn't it? So for some reason, this production and shipment is just stuck around the same mark. Now, is this a supply and demand thing, or I mean that requires quite a lot. So really and truthfully, that should be giving us enough demand to um, up production, surely. But it doesn't seem like it's chucking out enough to supply it. I don't... Ah, uh, is it? Oh, I see. Oh, I've just worked it out. It's because of the lack of deliveries, isn't it? Oh, dear God. Right, it's... Just stick four, another four on there. Yeah, I should have done bloody train, shouldn't I, really? But never mind. Um, I mean, that's not too bad. Let's just stick another two on there. Right, hopefully, yeah. Do you know what? I didn't even notice down there where it says stored. It keeps dropping to zero. So that's why production's so low, in it? Oh, such a bell end. Any stuff like this, feel free to point it out to me where I'm going wrong because I'd rather know how to be efficient at the game rather than cocking it up and you just screaming at the TV how I'm doing it wrong. <laughs> so, hopefully, with the increase in vehicles now moving the grain to the bakery. Hopefully that should 
up the production and shipment and that should yeah there we go it's, mo it's moving already now it's got a little bit more of a stable supply grain is moving right okay okay There we go, we're leveling up, maybe. <laughs> it's just got to keep them in the blue long enough for it to level up. So our long line that is um, miles away, has anything been dropped off there yet? I'm guessing not. Because they they do that little silly trip there first and then back again, don't they? I don't. Why don't they just start off here, pick some stuff up, and then go there, rather than go all the way there and then I've come all the way back empty-handed. Um. Actually, I only need ten, don't I? And how many do these carry? Um. Yeah, they carry five, so I only need two of these trucks, don't I, really? Um, I might actually just sell. Ah, uh, actually, no. No, I won't. Because what's been, what's waiting for them is, no, wrong one. Oh, there is enough, actually. Yeah, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to sell two of them vehicles. We only need two to pick up fully. Okay, build railway lines to bring workers from... So I need... Passenger trains to go from here to here to here and then to here. Okay. See what what is it about these trains that train lines that go off out the map? Don't understand that. There's another one here. What's that? What? Oh, it's a cargo station. Right, I'll tell you what we do. I think what I'll do is, I don't think we're going to start that now uh, because that's going to take too long. Um, what I will do is just, uh, are, we, are we nearly there yet on this? Have we got a couple of vehicles? Uh, these, these are them, aren't they? Yeah, so what I'll do is, once these have picked up and they are nearly heading, they're heading back, I will bring you back so that bit completes. And then I think this will be the end of part one because it's surprising how time goes. It just goes so quickly. Um, and then we'll sort all the train lines and everything out in part two. Um, because I think I think the best option to do would be to put the train station out here and then come round here and then another train station here and then or would I be better off I might be better off on this side actually train station here train station here and then just cut straight through the mountains um, I will actually just see if that will build a train line through. I wonder if that will, you know. So we go from here to here. I wonder if that will, but uh, not allowed to build or bulldoze here. So, hmm. So am I not allowed to go through? these mountains then. Huh. Oh, okay, yeah. 
So I literally can't, oh, okay. So I just literally need a train station from there to there, um, there to there. So I don't need to connect all four then, okay. So these trucks are on their way. What I'll do is I will bring you back once they're nearly there and I think we will call that the end of the video. But I'll bring you back when they're a bit closer to their destination and um, just so you can see that bit complete. And the first truck is just about to arrive. Well, I say truck, whatever it is, horse-drawn, carriage-y kind of little house on the prairie thing. Um, if you remember that. You were born in a good year. Here we go. The first one's arriving. Right. And the second one's not far behind. And that should complete that. Here we go. Nearly there. Done. What an adventure. Cara Ben Nemzi Effendi is deeply indebted to you for your services. Okay, so like I said, I'm going to call this one here um, because I think setting up the train lines, um, I'd like to set up the train lines pos properly. Um, and I think what I'm going to do is set up the train lines just a little bit outside the city like here and then probably do a bus route to the train line and then swing it around here and then a bus route around to bring people to the train station and the same with here um yeah the same here and here i'll probably put i might i might put the i don't know um yeah, I might put the train station maybe here or here. I might put it here actually, and then it can just swing over here like that. Job done. A little short, short little train journey, isn't it? But what I do is I'll pick that up in part two. This will do for part one, I think, because otherwise um, I'm going to be here for a while. Um, so we'll call episode six, part one done. And uh, I eventually realized my problems here, which, you know, <laughs> yeah, see, look, it's, it's, str it's struggling for um, ingredients to make the bread. It's just not getting enough, is it? So yeah, I think really what I should do, what I might do is put a couple of little train stations in <laughs> I, might, I might i don't know we'll see how it goes anyway thanks for watching guys and i will catch you in part two take care everyone bye bye